Libra, Libra, y'all. A yes, yes, y'all. A Libra, Libra, y'all. Yes, yes, y'all. Libra, Libra, y'all. Yes, yes, y'all. <laughs> What's good, Libra? Let's do your sign. And all signs, please. Jefferson, what are you messing with? All right, Aries, all the way to Pisces, please. If you're dealing with an Aries, this Aries have a cup of love waiting for you. It's like, can't you see that I'm interested? So this Aries is very fond of you, Libra. Yeah, there's the offer. But the Two of Swords is here. You don't really let them know if you're interested in them or not. They want you to, to let them know if you're dealing with a Taurus. This Taurus just sits and spies. You may have someone else, though. You could be in another relationship. They feel like that other person isn't for you. They are. This was an ex. And then you started dating someone new. And now this ex is spying on you. That's what I'm getting. Okay? And they feel like they can have you and treat you better. If you are dealing with a Gemini, this Gemini needs to stay outside. Because they're still giving to someone else. Don't let them back in. I don't care how much they beg. They are not key sweats, okay? If you're dealing with a cancer, if you're dealing with a cancer, this cancer is getting um, messages on you, about you, breakthrough and clarity. So whatever you are not telling them, their guides and spiritual readings are telling them. So if you would rather them hear it from the horse's mouth, I suggest telling them yourself. I don't know what it is. It could be good news. It doesn't have to be bad. If you are dealing with a Leo. This Leo is all the way invested. They want to keep moving forward with you. Okay, they're invested. They don't want anything else. They just want to keep investing. If you're dealing with a Virgo. This Leo, let me go back to Leo. This Leo is like, this is growing nice. I like the way this is growing. I hope it continues to do that. If you're dealing with um, a Virgo, this Virgo is conflicted. In due time, you'll know what you're supposed to do about this Virgo if you haven't already made a decision, okay? If you're dealing with a Libra. If you're dealing with a Libra. If you're dealing with a Libra, this Libra is having anxiety. Does Libra need a second? Okay? That's not the first time I said that today about a Libra. This Libra needs a second. Libra, this other Libra need a second, okay? If you're dealing with a Scorpio, this Scorpio is in love with you, like in love, in love with you. They're like, how come you don't see that? They may not be a Scorpio sun though, okay? All right, Libra, if you're dealing with the sage. The sage wants a family with you and wants to introduce you to their family. If you're dealing with a Capricorn. If you're dealing with a Capricorn, this Capricorn is happy with the way that things are going. All right. If they're breadcrumbing you, they're happy. If they're being generous with you, they're happy. They're happy with the way that things are going at this very moment. Okay. If you are dealing with an Aquarius. Doo -doo -doo -doo. 
I need to listen to some country music. Y'all send me some um some new ones, not old ones. Y'all gotta remember, I lived in Kentucky and ten in the Kentucky and Tennessee border, so we listen to country music. But we want I want to know some new ones. Give me some new sounds. If you are dealing with an Aquarius, this Aquarius is setting strong boundaries because they feel like you are their wish, but they want to make sure they're protecting themselves in case you change up on them. If you are dealing with a Pisces, this Pisces is like it's over. I'm done. I'm moving on to the next. Hopefully this helps.